Dietum has several functions for calculating frequency distributions from measurement signals. The signal value range is divided into classes or bins, and then Dietum counts how many measured values fit within each class. Dietum supports histogram classification, single classification, reducing classification, compound classification, and ring flow classification. A time at level histogram can help you quickly visualize the content of a large set of time series data. It may also be used to generate a duty cycle for a component or system. The Dietum single classification analysis with the classification method of time at level two will produce a result consisting of the amount of time a signal was within each class. Load the Dietum example file examplededata.tdm in order to follow this tutorial. In the data portal, collapse all of the channel groups and then expand the channel group named example. Right-click on the channel group, example, and choose the menu option, set default group, to cause any analysis generated channels to be created in this channel group. Activate the analysis panel and then choose the menu option statistics, single classification. In the single classification dialog, set the classification method to time at level two. Activate the channel selection tab and then drag and drop the speed channel from the data portal to the channel input control labeled Y channel. If necessary, drag and drop the time channel from the data portal to the channel input control labeled X channel. Activate the classification parameters tab. The class frequency calculation option allows you to choose between results in time, absolute, or as a percentage of the total time, relative. Set the class frequency calculation option to absolute. Set the determination mode to automatic. Set the number of classes to 10. Make sure the checkbox use open boundary classes is unchecked. Click the calculate button to generate the channel results. Close the dialog by clicking the close button. Two channels will be generated by the single classification analysis class mean, and time at level count to. Generate a 2D plot of the results in the view panel. Activate the view panel and clear it by using the menus File, New. Choose the regular worksheet partitions group bar and then the option Two Areas. In the data portal, select the channel class mean and then the channel time at level. Drag and drop the channels into the view sheet upper area. Choose 2D Axis System when the pop-up appears. Double-click in the center of the 2D Axis System area. In the 2D Axis System dialog, select the Type drop-down list for curve number one and change it from Line to Stair Curve. Click the OK button to accept the change and close the dialog. In the Data Portal, select the Channel Class Mean and then the Channel Time at Level. Drag and drop the channels into the view sheet lower area. Choose channel table when the pop-up appears. A much more useful visual of the time at level histogram results can be generated where the x-axis displays either the class mean values or the range for each class. Examples of such visuals generated in the report panel are shown. The report charts shown require generation of a channel with the labels derived from the classification class mean channel results. The two best ways to generate the channel with the labels and the report is to either use the free time at level histogram app from Mechatronic Solutions LLC or to modify and use the script provided with this tutorial.